at all these insurance guys calling me up like, I'm offering you top dollar. Why can't we get this case settled? Till the price of crawfish comes down, price of justice going up. Call Brad Egenberg. Welcome back. It's 550 here as Ray was talking about a wet drive for a few locations. We're doing fine just here in the immediate metro, but out near the spillway, once you get towards Laplace and 55 where it meets I-10 there, you can see a downpour. It's really just kind of parked itself. It's sitting there. It's been there for over 30 minutes, dumping heavy rain on the north side of Laplace and right over 55. So that's where your biggest shower is going to be. Zooming out here, you can get a scope of where the heaviest of the rain is. It's falling over a meet. It's falling over northern Washington Parish. It's raining like crazy over in Harrison County in Mississippi, and we've got showers back building through the upper Lafouche and back through uh, Assumption Parish. So that's where we have our showers at the moment. Our shower chances will likely increase across the metro in the coming hours, so we'll have rain on and off through the rest of the morning, watching for some localized heavy rain. And then once we get into the afternoon, rain chances dropping off, and that's going to be the start of a drier weekend. Rainfall totals, not everyone's going to see heavy, heavy rain, but a few spots, one to two inches. That's where we'll watch for isolated flooding. Rain chances highest this morning, lower this afternoon, and hopefully the rain this morning keeps our temperature comfortable in the 80s all day. I'm hoping that happens, but I tell you what, we're going to dry out Friday through Sunday and it gets hot. We'll be in the 90s Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then back in the 80s next week with more rain in the forecast. Still nothing to worry about in the tropics immediately. The Gulf is going to be quiet as it can be this weekend. The only thing we're going to watch long term is some enhanced moisture and some broad low pressure down here over Central America. It will try to lift to the north by the end of next week. So next weekend we'll be keeping an eye on some enhanced moisture in the Gulf. Still too early to say exactly exactly how that will evolve, but that's the overall pattern I see developing in about seven to 10 days. Our seven day forecast, nothing to worry about in the tropics here for the next seven days at least. It's a hot, dry weekend. Temperatures in the mid 90s, it'll feel about like 100. We'll watch for some storms this morning, but later on today and into tonight, things calm down if you're gonna be on the waters. Friday and Saturday are looking just fine. High tides gonna happen during the daytime hours for your Thursday and low tides happen later on tonight. We'll be right back.